I'm in Mongolia to discover what it means to be a modern day nomad. Wrestling is traditional in Mongolia. You know, was it physically difficult? Yes. Was I scared? Yes. Did I lose? I was slaughtered. What made it special was at the end of that whole day, I had this man speaking to me in Mongolian and sharing his philosophies of life. You need to be able to ride on horseback to be a nomad. Children learn to do this literally in many cases before they even learn to walk. I've never been on a horse in my life. There was no instructions. It was get on your horses and go. In that moment, it felt like there was no separation between myself, the horse, the earth, the land, the culture. It all blended into one, and I will remember that for the rest of my life. Mongolian life is extremely difficult, but you don't hear a lot of complaining. I don't even think they would define it in those terms as hard or difficult. It was just life. Could I survive as a nomad for more than a month? Pull, pull, pull. Definitely not. Just a glimpse into their experience will help to dissolve the wall between ourself and others. We can walk away feeling that this Mongolian wrestler, this Mongolian herdsman or nomad is just like us. Marty and I set out on an expedition to make the first print and interactive maps of Patagonia National Park to give people an on-the-ground perspective of what it's like to stand in the park itself.